Steed. Besides already knowing and studying every single pirate story ever, and dreaming about all that glorious and glamorous life, was also very curious about one rather interesting rumor. Oh yeah, mate, the pirates call it being gay. Oh. Don't even worry. It was said that when spending a long time at sea, not having any contact with other humans besides the crew. A lot of sailors relied on each other to satisfy certain needs we all know most men have. And some even fell in love. It was common for pirates to even marry each other, since captains could do the ceremony. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today. He didn't know how to explain it, but his wish to become a pirate got even more intense somehow after learning this information. However, he insisted it was only for research purposes, of course. Oh my. After meeting Blackbeard, though, everything changed. Hey, thank you so much for checking out the video. I voiced it. If you like our flag means death, I have a fandom Discord server I run with other cool members of the fandom, like Laurent Sketches, who made us our arsenal of emotes featuring the Revenge Crew, or Musing Vagabond, hands down, the best Ed cosplayer. What do you do? I'm an accountant. Where do you work? At a place where accountants work. We host daily watch parties of the show. I do our flag means death fanfiction readings every Friday. And yes, Captain does the voices. I will read everything you link eventually. Also, tonight we're going to be playing Jackbox. What's the difference between most people and my keyboard? I hopefully have it dropped most. Actually, immediately after the premiere is over. So click the link in the pinned comment and board my dinghy. I was saying who lives in a pineapple under the tree. Under the sea. <laughs> I fucked up that lyric. Milkshake with two straws, please. Aw, Ed. Watch that freaking fast like we're drinking! Ow! Ed! Huh? Get over here! You gotta try this! Wow! It feels like I'm flying! Is this a reference to something? Is it? Not sure. Might be a little ahead of our times. As you wish, Captain. Huh? All right, so the local constabulary. Something LGBT corner. just What's happened to me. For, that, of course, stands for. Let's go bury oh, treasure. Well, perhaps. Let's get Blackbeard like therapy. Someone will die. A fun? No, not a fucking fun. A murder. Someday we'll drift, wood will drift back to me. It's just occurring to me my name might be stupid. Yes! Mm. Uh, and then try with the R. Uh, uh, okay, write it one more time. Uh, one more You're time. You're doing great, dear! Uh, um, is this okay? Ed, have you seen Steed's diary? I can't find it anywhere. Look, Lucius! I wrote Steed's name. And my name too. It's cool, isn't it? Yeah, that's really cool indeed. Just call me when you're done with your dumb love declarations, okay? Eight! Eight! Now that I've learned so much about piracy, I should get a proper pirate's tattoo! I don't know, mate. Uh, you ready for that kind of pain? May I remind you I've been stabbed twice? I am no longer a stranger to a painful prick. <laughs> all right, all right. What do you have in mind? I'm glad you asked. Lucius has been helping me brainstorm. Captain, literally the only function of an anchor is to sink. It's a metaphor. So, what do you think? I can't choose. Um, <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah, no, you're doing great. You're, you're doing great. Oh, cal calm? Calm down, Captain. You did it. You were very brave, Captain. It looks awesome, Captain. Congrats, Captain! <laughs> I'm a brave boy! I am! I'm a brave... I'm a brave boy! <laughs> God, I can't wait. Kiss? Kill! No! God, I can't wait to... Kill? 
Actually, that was Kiss this time. Ah. Oh. Oh. Are you the bad boy to my good boy? Mm, yes, I am. Disgusting! Get him out of here! Ah! Oh. <laughs> Hello, sailor. Fancy seeing you out tonight, sailor. Hey, Steve. Why'd you become a keeper? I was going to be married to someone I don't know. And I wanted to marry for love. They said only peasants married for love, so I became one. Took off with nothing but my body. With no money to my new identity, I went looking for a job. Just so happened there's a vacant spot here. I love the sea, so my choice was obvious. Maybe I'll be able to buy a boat someday and sail away with the person I love. <laughs> Could you admit? You don't know how fucking cute you are. Look at that. You wear fine things well. One, two, three, one, one, two, three, one, one, two, three, one, two, one. Um, Ed, what are you doing to the mast? Ah, um, oh, Ed, how thoughtful. Hmm, the middle part is actually where you got stepped. Ah, very resourceful. Hmm, thought it was a nice touch. Baby girl, sweetheart, pumpkin. Darling, dearest. We love it. Fucker! Shit stain! Twat! Only pirates have wigs. This is real hair, in case you were wondering. You know, I thought I'd have a cooler death than this. Something like... Like being eaten by a tiger. <laughs> I believe I can help you with that! Boss! We're full! Oh no, I'm being eaten to death by a tiger! Oh! Oh, but what a cool death! Oh no! Fuck you, bonnet! You're a good kitty, Steve. You're a good kitty, Steve. Oh! Is it. Is it? Mike Steve bonnet the best kitty cat in the West Indies. Ed. His name is Ed. His name is Ed? Aww, oh, Ed. Escape of the Pirate Ed would teach, also known as Blackbeard, who... So, how may I tell you goodnight? Any way you want to. May I? You may. Oh, uh, eucalyptus? Carindula honey? Mint, lemon, some personal favorites, orange zest, and lavender. Hmm. Good choice! That one is delectable. I got it from a strange old woman who... Uh. Ah. <coughs> Edward! Soap is for bathing, not eating! So it is delectable. It is. You want some? No! Well, no! <coughs> I definitely think whoever owns that is, like, e extremely hot, right? Yes, I want to be an extremely hot girl. Do you ever think of me and my two hands and wondered why they never soothed your fevers and wondered why they never tied your shoes and wondered why they never held you gently and wondered why they never had the chance to lose you. I've only known Blackbeard for a few weeks, but I can tell he needs help. Uh, he's wildly, insanely depressed. Depressed? <laughs> I'm the furthest thing from depressed. Do you think a depressed person could make this? No. 
dead! Please shut up! It's dead, you! Huh? What the oh. fuck? Kill! 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 Men are trash! You can never trust them for shit. Never mind, he texted big. Ah, uh, hey! I'll be with you in a sec! Oh. Hi there, I'm it. I uh, own the tattoo parlor across the street. Oh, yes! Uh, thanks for stopping by! No worries, mate. Uh, uh, let me tempt you with a drink. I think I got you. Do you? The fuck? How? Ta da! <laughs> uh, uh, sorry, um, uh, and thank you. Actually, smells lovely. What is he? Surprise! Uh, uh, give it a try, please. <laughs> oh! This is insane, mate! Oh. It's an oat lavender latte with quite a lot of sugar. You strike me as a person with a sweet disposition. Someone who can appreciate refined, elegant aromas. I've been on the other end of the ocean. I've seen many different sides of the sun. <laughs> well, I felt the earth shake beneath my feet. And wondered if my time was done. And I've dabbled in the darkest of places. I've done all kinds of drugs. But there's never been a high that's made me feel the embrace of love. You're stupid. I like that in a man. Ah, uh, babe, why am I in your phone as the proof? Ah, uh, babe, you're so smart and funny and sexy oh and kind oh. and sweet. But don't, I don't, love keep you. Going. Please tell me how great I, I love you. Anyway, as your boyfriend in law. My what? As your boyfriend in law? Me. So. I give that a solid 9 out of 10. Oh, yeah? I give you 11. I have this rubber oh, lizard. Yeah. Oh, there may have actually been some apokine powder in there. <laughs> it can't. Exploded. Keep going. All of the dogs were in it.